The use of the death penalty across the world is at its highest in five years. This according to a report by Amnesty International. More than one third of the recorded executions were for drug offences. Well, the report says that more than 28,000 people were on death row at the end of 2022. At least 883 people were executed across 20 countries that year. Well, as according to the report titled Death Sentences and Executions in 2022, Iran and Saudi Arabia have topped the list. 90% of the known executions took place in three nations. These were Iran, Saudi Arabia and Egypt. China, where the data on death penalty is actually kept a secret, is believed to have been, well, has believed to have executed thousands. That number, though, it remains unknown. Well, the 46-page report is titled Death Sentences and Executions in 2022. It says there has been a 53% rise compared to the number of executions during 2021. Well, the number of executions for Saudi Arabia was the highest in 30 years. The true number of executions around the world is unknown and always will be. And partly because China, Vietnam and North Korea, where the death penalty is used extensively, do not publish their numbers. Now, the report also states that five countries had resumed using the death penalty in 2022. These are Afghanistan, Kuwait, Myanmar, the state of Palestine and Singapore. According to the report, six countries abolished the death penalty fully or partially in 2022. These are Kazakhstan, Papua New Guinea, Sierra Leone, the Central African Republic, abolished capital republic, punishment, I should say, for all crimes. Now, whereas the Equatorial Guinea and Zambia abolished the death penalty for a certain number of crimes. Well, the head of Amnesty International, the UK's chief executive, the, he says the UK government regularly restates its formal opposition to the death penalty. But what is it actually doing to actively end its use in places like Iran, Saudi Arabia, Egypt or China.